What is up guys? I'm Haley, and today I'm going to be doing a review of the Oskin Space Heater. So I'm going to give you the pros and the cons of this product and then I'm going to share with you some of the things I picked up while living with it. And of course at any point in the video if you do want to check out this space heater I put an Amazon link down below for your convenience. So let's jump right into the first pro. So the first pro would have to be that this space heater heats up instantly. And when I mean instantly, I mean one second. One second, it's hot, it's ready to go, it's warmed up. That is because it is a PTC ceramic heating device. So it is good for your home and it heats up very, very quickly. So you do not have to wait for the 10 to 20 minutes for the actual unit to heat up. It heats up in about one second and five seconds to extremely hot. So moving on to the next pro, that would just have to be how small it is and how capable it is. So this thing is relatively small, it is about a foot high and half a foot wide and it can heat up a whole room. I have a pretty decent sized bedroom and it can heat up that just fine in the winter. If you're looking for a desk heater, you can place it on your desk, it'll heat you up directly. The basement, if you have a basement and you want to heat up a certain part of the room, this will work also small bedroom, bathroom, anything you want to heat up that's not a super huge room, this will do the trick. I find myself putting it on my desk for when I want an instant heat feeling, but if I just want my room to heat up gradually, this will do that, it'll just take a little bit longer. But again, if you keep it running, it'll keep that room toasty, warm, great for the winter, great for just a cold room in general. So again, this space heater is small, but can heat up a room just fine. And a reason why it can do this is that it does have a swivel option. So you press the swivel button and it will turn side to side so it'll reach the full area of the room so you don't have to turn it and it's not just heating the room in one direction. Now moving on to the next pro would have to be the safety features in this heater. So it has a tip over protection and overheating protection. What tip over protection means is if the device falls over it'll automatically shut off. I found this really handy because I have a big dog whose tail whacks into everything and my cat likes to knock over everything in its path. So when this thing does fall over it will turn off automatically so it won't hurt anything or make the floor super hot or burn through wood or furniture like that. And overheating protection is that when the device reach its certain amount of heat capacity that it can take a fan will turn on to automatically cool down the metal surrounding it and then automatically shut off the device. And this is a little bit of protection so the device does not overheat itself and become a liability table that you have set it on. The next pro would have to be the build quality of this thing. So there are two heat modes, a high and a low heat mode. The high heat mode is shown in bright red and then the lower heat mode is more of a dim red. Moving on, you have a fan mode which lights up in blue and that will just be like your normal everyday fan. And again, it has the on and off button and then the swivel option. So now moving on to what this thing is actually made out of, but it, the heating device and the front and side portions of the device are all wrapped in metal and the back where the air comes in through the the heater is plastic and so is the top where you press the buttons. That being said, the plastic that is used in this is a very good high quality plastic. It blends in perfectly seamlessly with the metal and I think it is a great combination and makes this so sleek and modern and not an eyesore. I really enjoy just looking at this thing in my room or on my desk. It's pleasant to look at and it does its job very well. Also in the back of it there is a handy dandy handle so if you are going to transport this from room to room it is very easy to do so. You just unplug the cord, pick it up, hold the handle, carry it to your next room. So now we're going to move on to the cons and a little bit of insight that I have had as an owner of this product. So the first con would have to be that you cannot place it on carpet so if you were going to place it on the floor it says explicitly not to do that, but that is expected since it is a small heating unit. There's a lot of heat packed into one thing, and it's very close to the ground, so I can see why it is not rated to sit on carpet. So I usually put it on a shelf or my desk, and that has worked fine for me, so it's not that big of a con in my personal life. So now we're going to move on to the insight that I've had while owning this. There is not really a big learning curve for this. The buttons are pretty self-explanatory. The only thing that threw me for a curve was that when you press the off button, it takes about 20 seconds for the actual unit to turn off. So the heating stops, but the fan goes for 20 seconds, and I found out that that was because the device is cooling itself off before it turns off. So the Ozkin Portable Space Heater, this is probably one of my favorite products I've ever purchased from Amazon just because it has great build quality. It can heat up pretty much any decent sized room a great price and just very very usable and easy to use overall. So if you are looking for a nice compact sleek modern looking space heater this is the one that I would recommend. So if you do not believe me go check out the Amazon reviews. 
I put a link down below if you're interested in the space heater just for your convenience. So go check that out. And if this video helped you out, I'd really appreciate it if you'd hit that like button down below. And if you're feeling really generous for the holiday season, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. But I was your review guide and I'll see you in the next video.